The H2O Decade to Decade Festival is back once again, known as one of South Africa's most iconic music festival brands. This year marks 20 years. Over the years, the event has attracted over 10,000 festival goers each year and has featured some of the world's finest DJs. This year's lineup includes over 65 of the best local talent, as well as a selection of legendary international DJs and artists. Well, to tell us more, we are joined in studio by organizers. It's sick, Bohabot, and DJ Mark Stent. Welcome to Morning Live. It's sick. <laughs> you have to, you have to forgive me if I messed up your name. It's okay. There. Everybody does. I'm used to it. <laughs> Apologies. The festival has been in existence for 20 years. It, that's quite something. Uh, how, what has kept it going over the years? What has sustained you guys? And what has just kept you guys moving forward and pushing the boundaries? I think uh, the most important thing is the fans. Now, we started this 20 years ago, we had a small vision and uh, it's just progressed to one of the most um, well-attended festivals in South Africa mm. and we have our fans to thank for it, you know, they support us every year. We try and push the boundaries of bringing all the top international artists and um, our biggest support has also been our local artists, which we always try and push and, you know, they have so many fans of their own. And I believe that has been the success of H2O over the last 20 years. Take us through um, just what happens at the festival for people, especially who have never attended but are, you know, keen. So uh, we have over five dance floors there. So it caters to all different um, genres of music, hip hop, house, um, techno. And, uh, you know, it's a very well organized event in terms of security. We work with uh, the police um, and, you know, security is our top priority. And each dance floor has got, um, you know, its own little feel to it. Uh, we have uh, pyro, uh, dancers. So we, we create quite a, an experience for people to, to attend, you know. And I think, you know, just people love to party, you know. <laughs> so, you know, everyone's looking for a good, a good party. And ours, I think, is one of the best in the country. Yeah, and Mark, people are looking to have you make them dance and keep them on their feet throughout the festival. Just bring us into your set and what it is that you'll be offering the festival goers. Look, I think for me, Edge to Us probably it probably is my favourite festival over the last two. It's, it's what launched my career originally, you know. So specifically today, I'm playing later just before the internationals, Cosmic Gate, and uh, looking to bring something a little bit different, some big room techno, um, you know, big room sounds, lots of energy, and that's what a main stage is supposed to be. Mm. You know? And since you started um, DJing your career, I mean, what have you noticed about what South African audiences like and respond to? It's been evolving, you know. It's there's been so many styles over time you know and uh, what I'm loving at the moment is the merging of styles of music you know there's you know Afro house is mixing with techno and house is mixing with hip-hop it's awesome and, and what I love about the, the H2O events is that there's a little bit of everybody you know mm. and it's, it's kind of bringing a flavor from every style of music um, every part of the country putting it all together there's something for everyone if you love hip-hop you know there's nasty C if you love trance there's cosmic gate you know and then obviously the guys that they see on a week-to-week -week basis no yeah. speaking of uh, the variety of artists that can be uh, found at the festival what what informs how you guys make the selections I think you know we do put it out to our fans and we uh, Cosmic Gate have been to the H2O event f a few times and you know this year it's their 20th anniversary as well and that's why we've tied it into our 20 years and um, you know we see who are the latest trends who are the up-and-coming DJs we try and do a mix of, of, of all these DJs. Hmm. And so are tickets still available? Can Tickets are still available, through? yes. Uh, we do have limited tickets at the door uh, and people can still purchase through uh, the online ticketing system. If they just go to our Facebook page or to our website, they'll be able to find all the ticket links. Oh, fantastic. Mark, just uh, on the music front for you, mm. what's on the cards or what have you been up to? And uh, we're going into the festive season. What can people, uh, where can people catch you outside well, for, of the for, festival? For me specifically, I've just launched my third solo album. Um, it's doing very well on iTunes, it's called Solitude. Um, I've collabed with some of the top artists in South Africa, just been nominated for EDM Track of the Year oh, with a track I did with Danny Kay. So a lot more live, lots more shows, um, lots more production. I mean, specifically tonight I'll be playing probably about 95% my own music um, wow. on the stage, which will be cool, got a bit of a live element. So yeah, as I say, H2O is my home. You know, I've been there playing it for 20 years. I always feel like 
it's the place of like rebirth every year. You know, they they followed my career. They seem to evolve with the scene, mm. and they've got a massive plant on growing artists like me, the local guys, getting behind us, giving us a platform. You know, with ten thousand or however many people that they do each yeah. year. You know, it's like what is the next? Five, ten, even twenty years look like for H two O. I mean, what are some of the benchmarks that you still want to smash? What are some of the targets, the interesting things that you still want to add onto this festival? You know, I think, you know, we've just set such a precedent. So every year we we try and just get better and better. Up the you bar. Know, we do try and up the bar all the time. And you know, every year we try and make our stages bigger, better. Yeah. Um, you know, the latest technical equipment that comes out, we try and you know showcase it to everybody. Uh, and in all other all other aspects, you know, of giving the customers the experience, you know, we move forward with the latest technology, the apps, the booking systems, and you know, so I'd, I think for, I, I think we'll still be here in the next 20 years, if you want to know. Absolutely, I, I, I think so too. Just to, to to close it off, who are some of the people that have really collaborated with you guys and ensured that you guys not only have the funds but you know access to resources to help you guys continue to do um, the amazing work that you do. You know, I think our team that we have, um, you know, just our founding team, my mm. partner Dave Forbes and Ricardo da Costa, um, our team itself is, I think, our strength. You know, and we've got so many contacts all over the world that we've established for so many years. And we have the support of the artists, we have the support of the agents. And I think working together, you know, that's how we actually make our brand stronger. Mm. All right, Mark, where can people catch you on social media or bookings? Um, where can they Markstent.com mm -hmm. is the easiest. Um, info at markstent.com for bookings and all my social media is under Mark Stent, my name. All right, James, yeah. thank you so thank much you. for coming and all the best. Thank you for having us, Thank you so much. As organizer, uh, it's uh, Bohot, uh, Bobot rather, and uh, DJ Mark Stent talking to us about the H2O Decade to Decade Festival, which is set uh, to take place today. Tickets are still available, so make sure you get yours and go check out some amazing uh, music. It's a great festival. You'll meet lovely people. And of course, uh, just enjoy everything that is on offer. We're going to take a quick break. Uh, do stay with us. We'll bring you more after this.